You could drive all over Memphis. You never run out of the smell of barbecue smoke. You go to Washington, you want to see Washington Monument. You go to New York, you want to see the Empire State Building. You come to Memphis, you want to come to the rendezvous. I am Percy J. Norris, longtime waiter at the rendezvous. I'm here because this is where I'm supposed to be. Y'all call it the rendezvous and we call it just the boot. This is the place that invented dry rub ribs. No one was doing this before they were. You bust tables for two, three, four, five years. Then you maybe tend bar, do dishes. Then you maybe cook. You know, it's kind of like an apprenticeship. Either you can come to the run and we'll listen to what we're telling or getting on you about, or you don't. The ones that's coming up now, they don't, we, I'm talking, we go through bus boys like water. They just come in and get the t-shirt and the hat. <laughs> Times have changed. The rendezvous has changed. Uh, we stuck together like family. You know, but now it doesn't exist like that. All these old rendezvous boys here. Some of them are deceased now. One deceased. Two, three, four. The name is there, but the game didn't change. I mean, the business is really important, but the last thing you want is to destroy the family. We're really desperately trying to get the business into a third generation. If I can last another two years, i got to give up something. I feel a huge responsibility and a huge weight being sort of the person that's between, you know, the next generation. Together for 40 some years, he looked up and, you know, he's no longer there. It hurts. It hurts a whole lot. There's really a lot of pressure to keep it maintained and the competition is fierce. It's like in the heyday of the Yankees, all you can do is go down. They have been fixtures here at the rendezvous for a combined 100 years. Big Robert and Percy, legends here, are retiring. When you talk about these rendezvous waiters, you're talking about Memphis. Who would have thought two fires, dying downtown, recession, that we would still be here today, 70 years? What makes the rib so great? The guy's soul that lives in those bones. He was like, well, it's a new slab. It's never a new slab. <laughs> it's never a new slab. Once you become a rendezvous guy, you stay as a rendezvous guy.